Hey everyone, happy Mental Health Awareness Month. My name is Antonio Lorenzo. I'm an author from New York. Uh, a little bit about me, I am 29, fresh on my own mental health journey, Italian Dominican. I love writing, love poetry. Uh, I dance, I'm a trained actor as well, so all the performances. Uh, my own journey with mental health is pretty much about what we're trying to do here, like breaking the stigma. I discover that I have general anxiety disorder last year, right in the beginning of 2020. I mean, I know the pandemic definitely had a lot of people realizing, you know, maybe things that were going on with them this whole time. And it took this like solo time or this, you know, crazy situation that's happening in the world to discover what's going on. And for me, I started realizing like I had a lot of triggers in my life and I, I always had this kind of like, What's the feeling? Like, sort of like a, I have to do something, right? Like this kind of like pressure in my back, in my head. I'm like thinking 30 million thoughts, and then I had to solve everything and keep everything going. And I, I would, I would stress myself out thinking that I would have to do 25 million things in a second, and very catastrophic thinking. So one day, I ended up just writing out all my feelings in poetry, and I was able to publish my first book about self sabotage and anxiety. And that first book. Falling Angel Rise in Phoenix led into me finding a therapist and also discovering ADAA, which is amazing in itself. And, and between what I love about ADAA is uh, the blogs. I'm able to see uh, people that are going through similar stuff, you know, and, and, and writing what helps them. And I myself was able to publish a article about anxiety and boundaries and really uh, sort of it's just tips of like how how any way that I could help with someone that's going through something similar with anxiety disorder. And I'm still in therapy and going bi-weekly and it's honestly been an amazing journey. I've learned so much about myself, who I am, uh, what what my my mind, body, and soul needs and my triggers and also, you know, my, my limitations and boundaries for myself to make sure I'm okay. And I, and I want to break the stigma that it's okay to not be okay. And, and with that being said, I share this through my art and between my first book falling into rise and feelings about the anxiety to my second book romance in modern world and always having my heart broken and and really getting into like a dark hole to my third book that just came out antonio's return that's about everything i learned in the past two years on my way to 30 i've learned boundaries i've learned how some people can be a trigger for you i've learned limitations i've learned uh, what i need like hydration meditation and that it's okay to not be okay but before I end this video, I just want to say, know what works for you and do cater to your sensitivities. Bye.